this environment can be harsh on people. I mean, you have to learn to adapt and quickly. Submissive isn't a word we like to use out here. Survival of the fittest. Now that's the best mindset. So in regards to this environment, would you class yourself as the fittest? No doubt about it. People, people over time have learned not to mess with me. You know, uh, if anything goes down, if anyone gets in my way. Are you quite proficient with a gun? Yes, yes, I'm more than uh, quite proficient with a gun. Really? Always the last man standing, you know. Uh, haven't missed a mark yet. So you have killed people? Oh yes, I've killed many men. Mm. All in the name of justice, of course. So how many men have you killed? Hmm, well, see now. It was, uh, it was Joey, Bradley, Stephen, that was uh, his two brothers, uh, and there was, um, uh, one bullet, I was my best, uh, I've lost count, um, more than 15, though. Definitely more than 15. Would you say that you're quite notorious? No, I guess notorious would be the wrong word. Uh, famous? Yes. Notorious, no. Feared by the bad, respected by the good. Because you see, you can't kill a man without knowing for sure he deserves it. I mean, uh, I mean, I've seen a lot of bad men in my time, you know. I can spot a bad man, easy I can shoot birds out in the sky. I've also spent a lot of time in the company of bad men. You know, enough time to realize who deserves to live and who don't. Good people need a man like me to take justice into his own hands. You know, uh, Someone willing to stand up and fight, you know, for good over evil. My father was a good man. You know, he's, uh, he was always looking out for other people. That was until the bad men took him away. Bad men have a habit of taking things away. Especially things that mean a lot to other people. Like my father did to me. Jack? Jack? Jack, do you ever think that maybe you're not a cowboy? Jack Ellis, born in Perth, Western Australia, 1984. Referred to us for displaying episodes of psychotic behavior. Do you know what psychotic behavior is, Jack? It's when someone doesn't know what's real and what's unreal. One of the symptoms can be delusional thoughts. That's when someone believes something's happening despite all evidence to the contrary. A false belief. Do you really believe that you're a cowboy?
But I am a cowboy. Look over here. Get down. I think we're okay. It's okay. False alarm. Never can be too careful.